Well, Bobby, welcome to the, to the football club. I, I guess it's been a, an interesting time for you over the last uh, three or four months. Why Peterborough, though? What made this an attractive proposition for you? Um, obviously, when I came, uh, the gaffer and all the staff are really friend <laughs> friendly and um, I've just been shown that I can be given the opportunity. Um, everyone's wants me here and, and that's a nice feeling, if you know what I mean. Um, the training ground, everyone here is just, just professional and, and that's what I need to take my uh, game to the next step. Yeah, as I say, it's been it's been difficult because obviously the way things finished at Bury meant that you were all sort of looking for opportunities. I know you've been to play the game at Brighton as well. Is that is that the key, just trying to get yourself out there and, and show what, what you can do? Yeah, you've just got to, just got to keep working hard and and try and prove to places that that you are good enough and and keep professional, keep doing your your bits in the gym. Because I didn't play a game for three weeks, but I had to make sure that I was still doing my own stuff. And so when I got that opportunity, I was ready. And luckily, I uh, had a good game at Brighton, and then um, that showed for for I'm here now. So. And in terms of um, obviously coming through the ranks at Bury after you started at Norwich, obviously you went to Bury and, and came through their latter part of the academy. Obviously you played against Peterborough in the Youth Cup last year. That you had a really good bunch of, of lads at Bury. What was that team like to play with? Uh, it was amazing. Like the uh, Ryan Kidd, Mark Liverland, the coaches, uh, unbelievable. It was like a real family. And when I came here, that's the vibe I got. Um, so that's I think what I needed. Um, the players as well, top class. They've all gone on to to high things so yeah nothing but but praise and uh, for them yeah and what was that FA Youth Cup run like because obviously you say you beat Peterborough but you you kept on going didn't you and ended up playing Liverpool I think wasn't it in the in the quarterfinals of the competition I mean you've had a good uh, record as a club in the Youth Cup but what was it about that that competition that brought the best out of you guys it was sort of because we're we were seen as little old Berry and when we get to the quarterfinals of of the cup against Liverpool, especially playing at Gig Lane. Um, that was big for, for not only the youth team, but for all the fans as well, because playing someone like Liverpool, that's that's a big thing. And, and the, the run itself, we think we had three away games, Stevenage, Peterborough and and Lat Presswich. Um, but yeah, great run and, and it's credit to all the staff and, and the fans as well for their support throughout. And I guess you see this now as the next chapter, isn't it? Because you're coming on a, on a professional contract, which gives you the opportunity to obviously train with the first team under Darren Ferguson. And I guess that's the opportunity now for, for this season is to, to show on the training ground what you can do and see where it takes you. Yeah, that's uh, the, probably the biggest thing that uh, brought me here. The, uh, I'm now a professional and the hard work over the last 10 years that's got me here and doing all my extra work and and obviously people at Bury and Norwich that have helped me get here and my family. So um, it's a massive thank you to them. Um, so I've just got to keep working hard and show the gaffer that I'm ready. So yeah, You mentioned the family there. I mean, they, they sometimes get overlooked as a footballer, don't they? Because they end up driving you all over the place. And because you're based actually in Deerham, you know, playing at Bury for so long, I'd imagine they've been coming and driving up the motorways to come and watch you play and, and see you and obviously coming down here. Now, I guess it's a good opportunity, isn't it, to, to, to repay them a little bit for what they've done for you? No, exactly. Like yesterday was a, a nice day for, for not just me, but for all of us, because everything that they've done for me, I can sort of repay them. And now I just got to work even harder to to repay him again in the future. Yeah, that's a central defender, I, I guess. First and foremost, you want to defend, but I guess the modern day defender is 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 so much more than that, isn't it? You need to have a few more strings to your bow. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I'm a, a ball playing centre half, so obviously I like to defend them when they're doing tackles, but also I like starting attacks and and creating creating goals for the team.